I'm just reading uh, Cosmo because that's what I do. I'm a Cosmo reader. Yeah, are? Through and through, pretty much, yeah. That's how men learn most things. Yes. About oh, women. really? Yeah. Come on. I did. I did that a lot as a teenager, and Curtis is still doing it. Absolutely. I mean, well, because I got the Twitter, and they're yeah, on the, the Twitter. the mentality of a teenager. The mentality. Uh, at Kenny Curtis is us if you want to uh, to follow us. But it is uh, relationship hacks, 15 of them. Mm-hmm. I'm not going to go through all 15 because some yeah. of them are pretty standard things like be nice and don't be a jerk. <laughs> but uh, okay, listen to number eight. And okay. this is something that I bet. Oh, here we go. I, I can tell by the look on your face that a slam Connie and Dan is coming. I bet this is a Connie and Dan thing. Okay. Well, I, I bet you wish this would happen. And Nick, you think about this. Jay, you think about if you would like someone to do this for you. Okay. Number eight of 15 relationship hacks. Mm -hmm. Prep their toothbrush for brushing before they go to bed. Then just set it right there on the sink. Like have their toothpaste on the toothbrush. Hmm. Now that's something I bet if you walked into a bathroom and saw that, you'd be like, oh, Dan loves me. (laughs) I would think it was sweet, but when you say it, it reminds me a little bit of, what's that Julia Roberts movie? Pretty Woman. No. <laughs> <laughs> We're the dude. Aaron Brockovich. No. Ocean's 12. No. Gravity? No. Is she in Gravity? No, wait. The guy was super controlling. <laughs> no, he was abusive and controlling and everything had to be in its perfect place. And if it wasn't, she... Jay? It's called Sleeping with the Enemy. Sleeping with the Enemy. Okay. Uh, it, depending on who puts what on your toothbrush... That's what a little bit Wait, what that reminds me of. We're only doing toothpaste. <laughs> <laughs> and it's Dan. <laughs> okay. It's, I, I mean, no. Not, if Dan did it, I would think it was sweet. You're not walking But into he does a not do that. No, no one does that. No. Cosmo thinks that this is what we want. Like, if I know that you're tired, uh, and, and then I say, oh, Connie's real Don't tired. Don't you think it's kind of sweet? She can't squeeze toothpaste onto her brush. <laughs> I better do it and set it here. Uh, I don't know. Don't you think it's kind of sweet? I would not, because I don't think that my... Uh, bathroom counter is very clean. Oh. Like it's got poo particles? Well, it's got the poo <laughs> particles. It's got, who knows, like hair from me shaving. and okay. you know, I mean, there's so much just junk. Why don't you clean? Well, I mean, you yeah, give it a wipe, but how, how clean is it really? And then you got your toothbrush there. My toothbrush doesn't t- touch the vanity. Okay. Does yours? Nick? I wouldn't like no. that. I, I think she's trying to tell me something. Like, you got dirty I don't mouth. brush my teeth. Yeah. You got the What's dirty. up with that? Oh, so I think you feel that way anyway, then. Oh, That's you got dirty oh. mouth? <clears throat> you got to put Nick me down. Nick has the dirty <laughs> mouth. No, I, I just wonder why you would think that. Yeah. Well, I, that's, I worry about my breath. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> that's a good way to be. Okay. I don't want to just not go through life not worrying about no. your breath. No, that's no. true. You know when your breath is stanky. But, so anytime you see that someone has set out a toothbrush for you, you think, oh, I got stank I mouth? I hope she's got to make sure that I brush my teeth what, before yeah, I get She's in bed. just concerned about your mouth health. Yeah, you're not eight. <laughs> She's not your mom. What else is on the list, Curtis? Oh, okay, so these are uh, hacks, relationship style hacks. Uh, let them have the last bite, even though you're starving. So you, you're Ooh. sharing something, and you say, hey, you want the last bit of this? Yeah, go ahead and let them. Gina's good at that. I am not good at that. You just eat it. I'm so hungry. Yeah. <laughs> you are always hungry. Yes. Yeah. Dan um, always take. yeah, D- Dan gets last bite. Nick used to, when Nick was an intern, and Jay, take <laughs> notes here. So Jay's interning now. Mm-hmm. Uh, when Nick was our intern... Nick would come in, uh, and we'd be like, Nick, it's not your day. And he'd say, no, but I heard that there's going to be some food later on. Uh, <laughs> and then Nick would just be And then here. he wouldn't come in on his normal day. Right. He would take a take a. I'm a coming in today day. instead. Right. And we're like, you sitting there eating is not doing work. No kidding. You're not You're helping not out. you learning anything about radio. Exactly. Fail. Uh, give something Giant without fail. expecting something. <laughs> just do, yeah, do for do the that. good. Yeah. Um, let them pick the show or movie for once. Yeah, we do that. Yeah, where you guys will have a little mm-hmm. give and take. Uh, if you live together, um, just so this is if you are dating, okay, not married. From Cosmo. So this doesn't apply to us. Hex. Okay. This applies to you and Gina. Uh, okay, if you live together, just buy the milk and the toilet paper. Don't say anything about it. Like, hey, I bought milk and toilet paper. You just buy those things. Do you ever do that? Yeah. Yeah, you just buy it. Just buy it. You don't need to say, I bought that. Mm-hmm. You're welcome. Yeah. Um. Do something that they want to do, but maybe you're a little uncomfortable with it, uh, is number five. Like, if they suggest something, no. don't shoot it down immediately no. like you are here. <laughs> no. <laughs> Give it a chance. No. Is number five. No chance. Uh, if they invite you to a work event, these is Cosmo, Life uh, and Relationship mm-hmm. Hacks. If they invite you somewhere to a work event, okay. don't make plans right afterward where you're just checking your phone like, we got to go, we got to go. Allow them to have the day. 
Mm. You don't need to immediately go somewhere else. I wouldn't make plans. No, you're, you're right there. Uh, mm. If you know that their mom is coming to town, keep your schedule open. Because mm-hmm. maybe they'll swing by. Maybe they'll want to take you out. Who knows? I like Gina's mom. She's the best. She is the best. He's she's so in love. She's listening. She totally is she's listening. She's not listening. She's I, across the state. We she's radio- not listening. She hates your show. That's what I was waiting <laughs> for her to say. I was totally Here's waiting she for her to like. say No, that. she doesn't have the internet. <clears throat> very no. good. So she probably couldn't listen fast enough. And she's across the state. She doesn't have very good. She doesn't have the internet very good, so she can't listen fast <laughs> enough. Can't science fast enough. <laughs> We're very fast. Uh, make them uh, uh, coffee in the morning. Mm, which, okay. We don't oh, drink coffee. Gina does that. Okay. Oh, my Lord. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you just marry her? Money. I'd oh, like to. It costs like 35 bucks to get a marriage license. Yeah. She deserves better. Buy them new socks if they got uh, old <laughs> socks or pick up uh, some medicine if they're sick. Tuck them in at night, which you and Dan. Dan he tucks, tucks me in every in. night. Yeah. You don't tuck him in. He goes to bed too late. Yeah. Uh, say something uh, nice about them that is not about their looks. Oh, like, wow, you're, you're really good at reading. <laughs> You're a reader. You're a reader. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, something like that. You, you should sure know, know a lot about gas. <laughs> no, don't say that. Oline. Man, you stink out of the bottom. What was the last time You're you said- You're good at stinking. What, what is the last time? <laughs> what did you say? The last time you said something that was not- What is it again? Say something nice that's not about- Their body. What was the last time you said something nice to Katie that wasn't about her- <sighs> Let's be honest, her boobs. Okay, yeah, she's got great boobs. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I'm really trying to think. <laughs> About you and Dan? Mm-hmm. When he haven't complimented his cute little butt? Oh, yesterday. What'd you say? Oh, yeah, no, it was his butt. Um, <laughs> hold on, I'm trying to think. I got nothing. <laughs> Nick, when's the last time you said something nice about uh, Gina that was not about her body? It was yesterday. She was painting. I said, you're doing good at the art. <laughs> yep. Hey, you She's good at the art. Make me sick. Do you get that? Like the little <laughs> when he I talks. just think you should just get married You're already. You want to like be married syrup. so badly. It is sweet like syrup. It's so cute. Maybe she doesn't. So cute. Maybe this is, we see the one side. And then it's just really dark at home. She whips me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? And that's number 14 on the list.